Fort Myers, Florida, Red Sox President of Baseball Operations Dave Dombrowski said all offseason he does not plan to make a large expenditure for a closer. He's trying to keep the Red Sox's payroll under the $246 million third threshold. It's at approximately $238.8625 million right now. The Red Sox's top draft pick in 2020 will be moved back 10 slots if the payroll reaches or exceeds $246 million. They also will incur the highest tax penalty. And so Craig Kimbrell remains a free agent. It seems highly unlikely the Red Sox will re-sign him. I haven't talked to him, Kimbrell, in the last few weeks, Red Sox's Matt Barnes said. And I really haven't talked to any of the guys about him coming back. Craig's awesome. We love Craig. He's a phenomenal pitcher. But as of right now he's not in this team and we still have a job to do with or without him, the Red Sox might be willing to exceed the $246 million third threshold in 2019 if they could re-sign Kimbrell to a short-term contract of two or three years. That's only speculation. The first official workout for Red Sox pitchers and catchers will be here at the JetBlue Park Complex Wednesday. Dombrowski has named both Barnes and Ryan Brazier as the two frontrunners for the closer job. Dombrowski also named Stephen Wright and Tyler Thornburg as two internal candidates. Chris Sale gained weight. Boston Red Sox's Alex Cora says the ace did, but he still looks very thin. Red Sox manager Alex Cora was asked if it's likely either Barnes or Brazier will be the closer at the start of the season. For me, it's too early to answer that one, Cora said. I have to talk to the players first before I answer that. But we've got some capable guys who can get outs in the 7th, 8th, ninth inning. What Barnsey did last year was amazing. You start looking where he pitched during the regular season and during the playoffs, getting the 3, 4th, 5th hitters from the 7th inning on. He was amazing. Brazier did an outstanding job. For me, honestly it, it's too soon. I've got to sit down with them and talk to them. I don't want anybody to come here and try to win a job in the first day of spring training, Barnes said he didn't come to spring training with a mindset he's the closer, I'm coming in spring training trying to get ready and get outs in whatever role they put me in, Barnes said. Whatever they need, Barnes added. Whether it's the fourth inning to get some guys out or whether it's the ninth inning closing games out, he's surprised Kimbrell remains unsigned, yeah, him and everybody else. You've got some of the top free agents, top players in the game who still aren't on teams. So yeah, I think that in itself is a surprise.